I am going to show you how to fix bad image error problem on your Windows 11 system. In the first step, we need to right click on our taskbar, then open task manager. On this window, click on run new task, then select browse button. Now on this window, we need to select this PC, C drive, then Windows folder, then find out system32 folder and double click on it to open it. Again, find out cmd.exe file. Then, so here it is. Select it, click on open. Then, check this box and click on OK. Now, it will open command prompt window. We need to execute some commands carefully. So, type in prompt and hit enter then type chkdsk and hit enter to execute the command this command will take some time to complete the process so wait for it once done we need to type in assoc and simply hit enter after that type exit to close the command prompt window then simply move to the next step now we need to open file explorer so press windows key plus e key together now open this pc c drive windows folder and then system32 folder now we need to find out msvcp uh, 140.dll file so just go down scroll down and search for it so here it is we need to right click on it and select delete once done close this window go to search bar and we need to open uh, any web browser uh, like uh, google chrome or microsoft edge so open it then find out msvcp 140.dll download then from the www.dll-files.com click on this link then just scroll down and need to click on download button then you need to wait for 3-4 seconds after that it will download the file automatically open its file location close the web browser simply copy it then go to this PC, C drive, Windows folder and system32 folder. Now copy paste that uh, file here. Simply paste it. Click on continue. There we go. Okay now on the same window we need to find appviz. So here it is appviz.cpl then we need to right click on it select delete so it will ask you file access denied you need to permission to perform this action so right click on it select properties then go to security tab and then we need to select advanced then click on change and then select advanced and then click on find now to select the username you can find uh, simply right click here and select you can find out your username here then select it click on ok then from auditing select it and click on remove and click on apply and then ok now simply edit this, select it, check these boxes, from users you need to select this, click on OK and then click on OK. Now select it and right click on delete. There we go. That's it guys. Just restart your system, your problem will be solved and you are good to go.